Hello dear friends and welcome to the Geo Coast. Here I'm standing um, on a cliff top overlooking the Church Bay uh, just at the entrance to Cork Harbour and I would like to discuss the main geomorphological features that we see in this bay. So here we can see a combination of erosional and depositional features. So first of all on the left you see some wave card rocks which we can call shore platform and then it is backed by the beach sediments mainly represented by gravel with some sand and at the back we see the combination cliffs combined with rock and soil cliffs and the soil is represented by the glacial teal deposits from the last glacial period and the sediments on the beach they are supplied actually through the erosion of these glacial teal deposits and as well as um, they're supplied from the offshore. So these are the main geomorphological features that we can see in this little bay. Now I came down to the beach to have a closer look at the features that we saw from the cliff top and actually the rocks that, uh, that front the beach it's not a classical shore platform this rock's been eroded by the action of waves but um, they're sticking out at an angle due to their bedding pattern so there we can see like a standalone sea stack formed with a glacial teal unit here we can see some slumping of glacial teal material as the cliffs were undercut by the wave action during the winter storm And here it's an interesting feature so um, this probably was formed due to the seepage of rainwater through the upper glacial teal unit forming a cave in the soft sediments. And the rocks that we see on the beach, they're also representative of the local geology. We can see the red and green Devonian sandstones, which are about 400 million years old. Same color as the bedrock uh, exposed at the beach here. So, here you go. These are the main geomorphological features of the George Bay in Cork Harbor.